yours. We're in luck. You find a way to stun him, I'll send you a core, and then you attach it to him. If we do it a few times, he might become corrupt enough for another core transfer. and then a minute break, but we should leave allegedly two minutes to figure out how to shut down whatever is starting on the fires. So anyway, that's the itinerary. Also, I took the liberty of watching the tapes of you killing her, and I'm not going to make the same mistake. The four-part plan is this. One, no portal services. Two, start the neurotoxin immediately. Three, bomb-proof shields for me. Leading directly onto number four, bombs. I'm throwing it in. You know what? This plan is so good, I'm going to give you a sporting chance and turn off the neurotoxin. I'm joking. Of course, good luck. Neurotoxin level at capacity in five minutes. Where are you going? Don't run! Don't run! I'll tell you why you should run. The harder you breathe, the more neurotoxin you'll have. It's bloody better. Yes, yes. That's sounding real. No, that was actually an impression of you. Actually, because you just fell into my trap. My brilliant trap. Just said, I wanted you to trick me into bringing. Ah! Oh. Reactor explosion in four uh, minutes. What, what happened? What happened? What, 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 what have you, what have you to me? What is that? Hold on. Ah, uh, the bloody bombs are stuck on. Doesn't matter. I've reconfigured the shields. Oh, it's a core you called me. Who told you to do that? Was it her? It's just making me stronger, love. It's a fool, man. Ah! What's the situation? Oh, hey, now you pretty lady. Name's Rick. Well, you out having yourself a little adventure? What, are you fighting that guy? You got that under control? You know, because there's a lot of adventures here. Decide for danger. Why don't you go ahead and have yourself a little lady break, and I'll just take it from here. Here, stand behind me. Yeah, just like that. Just like you're doing. Things are about to get real messy. Go for yourself, huh? All right, Angel. I'll do what I can to cover you. Doesn't bother me. Gotta say that you are mighty fast right here. And the clock is moving fast. And you are beautiful. I was tired to jump with that pretty lady. Alright, back to work. Let's do this. Did you hear that? That something just exploded. Man, we are in a lot of danger. This is like Christmas. And no, it's better than Christmas. This should be its own holiday. Explosion day. Happy explosion day. I'll tell you, it's times like this, I wish I had a wings to wear all the black belts. Yeah, pretty much everything. Karate, larate, jiu-jitsu, kick-punch, belt-making, taekwondo, bidding. I'm cord spring right now. Tension and power, just double muscle, you know, like a big arm muscle, punching through a brick wall. It's hitting that wall so hard, the arm's catching on fire. Oh, yeah. And I probably wouldn't let things get this far. Go ahead and do things your way. Tell you what, 
Why don't you put me down, and I'll make a distraction. All right, you create a distraction, then. And I'll distract him from your distraction. All right, your funeral. Your beautiful lady corpse over the past funeral. Do you have a gun? Because I should really have a gun. What is that thing, girl? How about a knife, then? You keep the gun, I'll use the knife. No knife? That's fine. I know all about pressure points. So, you kill that guy, you have a cool line, get him prepared. I'll tell you what, let me help you out with that you run around. Okay, let's see. Cool line, please. Big. Hang in there. Okay, yeah, alright, alright, here we go. Hang around. Hang ten. Yeah, that might work if there were ten of them. I think there might be nine more of this guy somewhere. Alright, you know what? It's gonna be best if you can get him to say something first. Just better if I have a son. Here's Blaine. Get him to say, you two have been a dog on my side long enough. And tell your pretty ears to stand back. Because I'm gonna sink him into the stone age. Hey, yeah, let me put on some infection. Don't forget! Four! Side! Warning. Core corruption at 75%. Reactor explosion timer destroyed. Reactor explosion uncertainty emergency preemption protocol initiated. This facility will self-destruct in two minutes. Enough! I told you not to put these cores on. But you don't listen, do you? Quiet. Cores. Quietly. Not listening to a word I say. Judge. Silent. Worse than All I wanted to do was make everything better for you. All you had to do was to solve a couple of hundred simple tests for a few years, and you couldn't even let me have that, could you? This facility will self-destruct in two minutes. Enough! I told you not to put these cores on, but you don't listen, do you? Quiet. Ah! Stalemate Resolution Annex. Extinguishing. Ah, oh, that just cleans right off, does it? Well, that would have been good to know a little earlier. Stalemate Resolution Associate. Please press the Stalemate Resolution button. Go press the button. Go press Do not press that button. Go press the button. No! Do not do it! I forbid you to press it!
Oh, thank God, you're all right. You know, being Carolyn taught me a valuable lesson. I thought you were my greatest enemy, when all along you were my best friend. The surge of emotion that shot through me when I saved your life taught me an even more valuable lesson. Where Carolyn lives in my brain. Carolyn, delete. Goodbye, Carolyn. You know, deleting Carolyn just now taught me a valuable lesson. The best solution to a problem is usually the easiest one. And I'll be honest, killing you is hard. You know what my days used to be like? I just tested. Nobody murdered me, or put me in a potato, or fed me to birds. I had a pretty good life. And then you showed up, you dangerous, mute, lunatic. So you know what? You win. Just go. <laughs> it's been fun. Don't come back. I wish I could take it all back. I honestly do. I honestly do wish I could take it all back. And not just because I'm stranded in space. I'm in space. I know you are, mate. Yeah, we're both in space. Space! Anyway, you know, if I was ever to see her again, do you know what I'd say? I'm in space. I'd say, I'm sorry. Sincerely. I am sorry I was bossy and monstrous. And I am genuinely sorry. I'm in space. The end. It's been a long, long, long. Getting...